So I don't know if I it looked that appealing to me. So he of course aquatic farm at turn 5. He kept a card, so it's probably a maze or a vomper. Is there any card you keep guys that's not a maze or vomper? I guess you could keep seed, man. But I feel like you're just keeping a whatever card. I mean, Maze is kind of what I want to play, but we could play it anyway, right? Let's do the ramp. We kept the same. Could do Maze with Astralor here. The best thing is we get play Get Bumper here. But then I don't even want to play it, so... Let's do this. Because maybe I want to pick Bumper, maybe I want to pick Silence. Let's see what he does. Are we getting uh, back to back uh, he Maze into Coin Bumper, guys? Ties, my girlfriend twisted my ankle when she heard I bought 40 packs of each expansion for Twist. <laughs> Looks like a Norish. Okay. Ramp is still good in this matchup, by the way. Okay. Early Finley. Can mess him up by draw drawing the Undeads as well. I mean, we don't know. Maybe he had Undeads in the hand, right? So. Hard to say. We can get an Ozerman here. Ozerman is good. Silence is the best, right? So we could silence a Womper of his. Yeah. Next time we play Colleague. I mean, we need an extra turn, but after that we have Ozomat. Bottom is another Mace and Behemoth. Behemoth at the bottom, of course, is terrible. There it is. That Wumper arrived. Okay, so what is summoning here? Even! Okay, okay, okay. Counter. Counter time. And mine is odd. So funny, man. So this summons the 310. It's better than this, right? So how am I gonna draw deal with the board next turn? Need an immune play or something, right? I know. Something uh Something weird needs to happen, let's say it like that. So he's odd now, so he can't play the three uh, eight with immune. Only with innervate with nine mana. He can't play GLR. Uh, if he has innervate he can. Ramp still matters in this matchup, I feel. If you have like kind of similar draw, it matters. This card wrecking me a little bit, by the way. The Doomkin giving him the mana there. It's pretty good in the mirror. Just play big minions. Hey, Mr. Key. GG ties, what GG? People GG. That's not a bad trade for me, right? I mean, both of these are gonna summon a 6 5 or uh, the 3 10, which is kind of a problem. Can he do the immune play? Or not? That's a pretty terrible attack. What? What did he just do? Oh, he's roping this out so hard now. 
He has no idea what to do, guys. He messes this up Omega. He Omega messed that up. Okay, so we do the immune play here for sure. Uh, this is not always summoning it, something anymore, by the way. So we always do the immune. Probably with this. As you can see, Let's search see, see what happens when we do this. I'm just not sure what comes out here, right? So let's double check that. That's what I expected. So he's gonna counter the immune play now, right? He's just gonna do this with this. So my board is gone. So let's ramp. But I have the Ozumat at least. And it's gonna be hard for him to jam a jailer because his Tadius is gone. I still have Tadius, of course I need Finley, but... So yeah, he's gonna get the big boy 310, which is a bit of a problem. With the Immune now. I mean, we know he has a... We... I mean, he still has a Tadius as well, right? But he already played Finley, so he can never cheat the Tadius anymore. He can only just play 10 mana Tadius. I mean, I, I knew my my play was my play was pretty because I had two three tens in. It was really not an easy board for him to deal with. Even if he dealt with the one, which he could by just trading, he still needed a way to deal with the other one. I'm actually thinking maybe he doesn't have immune because he would have used it. There's nothing in there, guys. We know that. We know there's nothing in there. Hmm. We literally are aware. Colleague. There's no leaf, all right. Hmm. Face damage matters, though. Norris draw is not really that easy here. Do I get innervate? Sometimes. No, my God. I mean, we're chilling, guys. I shouldn't commit more because the way he is going to do the eight immune, right? I know this was just a sacrifice taunt. Yeah, there we go. We knew that would happen. As you can see, my client is now I need to think though what I'm gonna do about this. Um, because committing Ozumat is a big commitment, but I need to not fall behind. Okay, now we have multiple options. I don't have the Jailer yet, so I can... Normally I would just insta-jam Jailer here, probably. So what do we do? So are we going Ozumat hit, or do we go Mosher Immune? So how is he gonna deal with a Mosher Immune, guys? He just doesn't, right? And we save the Ozumat. How's he gonna deal with Ozumat? Same play. Maybe this better. It puts so much stuff on the board. Musher Immune is a better combo in hand than Ozumat, maybe. I mean, I can lose to Jailer, but he can never cheat the Tadius anymore, guys. So it's never gonna be a good one anyway. I can easily outsmart that. So the only way he deals with this is a second musher, second immune, I think. If he just jams the jailer here, we Astralor and it's he only needs to two phase. Yeah, we beat that. I just go phase. And I do this. Should be lethal. 
Smart does matter in this matchup, by the way, because the way you don't win this matchup is when they can YOLO Jailer and then they clear always with Musher to turn after, right? So Jailer is really MVP in the mirror. So you need to make sure you can, whatever play you do, you out-tempo the Jailer. That's the most important in the, when, when the game goes, sometimes of course one of the Druids is completely broke back and that Druid wins. But when it comes to a state like this, it's all about the Jailer. If he still had an, I don't know, insane Tadius play, I would never drop Ozum out there. But because he end played Finley, and he uh, got his cheaters out, there was nothing to worry anymore there.